Art Rocks, Power and Passion, Part 2. Our artists are battling it out, and it's anyone's game. For Audrey, Nick, or Debbie. Do you guys have any favorites yet? Audrey! Audrey has a fan! How about the bad boy? Who's, a, who's rooting for the bad boy in summer? And Debbie and over here? Deb has some fans. We talked this week, and then I find out that she's also a hair sculptor. <laughs> Your other new passion. Yeah, I'm just an artist, a creator in every way. A dancer, a creator of outfits, a creator of hair, a creator of paintings, everything. Different people. Yeah, whatever. I really wanted to try and put myself in a mindset before I started so that I could tap into that mindset and really kind of like work from the way that I felt. All right, what do you have going on here, Nick? I'm not sure yet. I'm trying to figure that out. What are these? Where did the towers come from? Uh, that's the water towers, you know, to add textures to the buildings. We're going to try to find some sort of, you know, my passion down here with uh, everything pulling up over here. There was a lot of votes in this week, I have to tell you, because we started the voting early. So, who are you guys rooting for tonight? Nick, of course. Nick. Nick. All the way Nick. Oh, yeah. More or less, uh, he's a former Art Institute, San Francisco, California student, so he, he, he knows what's up. We went there, we went there, we gotta represent. Passion and power, or power and passion. What up my alley? Where are you alley? We're in the red right here, look there at that. Go. So, yes. ask, let me ask you, in bed, what is better, our, uh, passion or power? I can't pick from another P? I have to say right now, today, Audrey is my favorite. Audrey? Audrey, yes, because she, the way she paints and her whole body language, and she keeps flipping the painting back and forth, and we still don't know yet what it's gonna be, but it's just a work of progress is so interesting to watch, yeah. So tell me, do you have any preference so far? Um, well, I came here to see Devin, so I'm a friend of Devin's. Actually, you guys want the inside scoop? He's painting on my window frame. I think that you are rooting for uh, Devin, right? Yes, Okay, absolutely. so the vote is a little biased already. Well, yeah, and I love what he does. Hi, how are you guys doing tonight? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And that's not even power and passion. Look at that thing. That was amazing. This. Oh, this is, it was, see, it has Tunisia on it. I went to an art painting um, festival. They picked people from all over the world, only one person, or no, two people from each country. And I got invited to go to Tunisia. And this is. <laughs> Okay, there's 20 minutes left in this competition. So hopefully you've started to make, you have some idea who you're going to vote for. I mentioned the voting's been going on on social networking sites all week. But right now, Raina has some ballots that she's gonna be passing around. Five minutes left in the competition, and well, I'm often asked, how do we find our artists? And these artists all come from the MySoiree.net website, but we scout like crazy, and with everybody watching the Art Rock Show these days, the phone rings off the hook back at the headquarters, so it's not too hard to find our artists, but I tell you what, it's really hard to find really, really talented artists like we have here tonight with Bad Boy of Summer, Nick Giannani, Audrey Kroll, and Debbie and Reese. Come on, five seconds left, we gotta count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Art Rocks! Drop your brushes! That's it. Congratulations! Woo! Let's hear it! <laughs> Woo! Let's hear These it! These artists have poured their hearts into this competition, but the audience picks the winner. Watch part three of Power and Passion for the results. Well, everybody get down. This side. Baby, I don't care 
Watch it.